Appalachian Wireless is Appalachian Advantage. Unlimited text, talk, and two gigs of data for as low as $45 a month. Or if you like, get five lines on eight gigs of data for just $145 a month. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Longtime college professor and community volunteer Gail Lawson was an outspoken proponent of transportation equality in eastern Kentucky. Now her memory and her legacy will live on in a project she helped push forward. A bridge on the new U.S. 119 at the Harlan County Electric County line at Partridge was named in her honor. Speakers at a dedication ceremony at the bridge described Lawson and her persistence in pursuing transportation resources sorely needed in the region. She cared about her community. She cared about her state. She cared about her brothers and sisters. She wanted this road. She asked for this road. She begged for this road. She hounded people for this road. Why? Because she cared. She represented not only Harlan County, but she represented all of East Kentucky. So if each of us were a volunteer or a citizen advocate in the style of Gail Lawson, just think what a better world this might be. She was dedicated to use her own personal resources to be able to communicate the needs of the people of this area to improve Harlan County and this region. All of us who are gathered here know that when Gail Lawson took up a cause, you could be sure of one thing. She would know as much or more about that than anyone else, including the experts. In the end, it's the things that we do to help the others around us, not what our personal gains are. And I think that Miss Lawson was an ideal example of that person that truly loved this region, this area, and dedicated her life as her sole passion in the last years of her life after she retired from her other job. The US-119 project continues to progress in Letcher County, and officials hope to have the stretch of the project encompassing the Gail Lawson Memorial Bridge open by December 1st. In Partridge, Chris Anderson, EKB News.